so these are the characters I'm working with for Our Country's Good, which is big play, many characters and changes live on stage, which is quite unusual. Not something I have ever tried before to coordinate, but at the same time the coordination part is not really for me, but um, to decide on, obviously that's more for the director, excuse. Excuse this nail, it's me picking up my shellac, but just look at my nice rings instead. This book, I'm going to tell you, is the most amazing thing. I want to get a copy. It has some incredible, incredible explanations of just how to approach stuff like, so in this play, it's about the first convicts on a ship to Australia, or the first ship to Australia, and the captain, Arthur Phillips, is quite an egalitarian, I guess, and is encouraging kind of social reform by allowing the passengers on the ship, the passengers, law, the convicts on the ship, to put on a play. Um, which he, well, he's fighting with a lot of resistance, but eventually they kind of have to go along with it, the powers that be, because what are they going to do? These people are out at sea, so they can't really stop them. Um, and it's about colonization, themes of imprisonment, enslavement, what makes someone bad or good, um, nature versus, versus nurture. Um, and it's just a really powerful play on, sorry, like knocked into the chair then, powerful play about really important big issues that are still relevant today. So here is my costuming rack. We have all the characters here with, and on the other side, the person that plays them. It's really fun as well because the play has a lot of gender bending. I'll show you this. Um, amazing original jacket so heavy this one um, oops and what was I going to say yes lots of gender gender factor in this one so we have John Weishammer it's a comic played by Georgia who also plays the captain Arthur Phillips um, and then we have also Heather who plays the Reverend Johnson all this kind of cool stuff so it's just messing around with all the big issues. Do you like my signs I've made here? Very professional. Very, very professional. Didn't have a printer, so that's what we had to do. Um, yeah, here I am. Look at my sick hat. Why is this my pose currently? It's quite stressful, but yeah, look at these period accurate hats that I found. 18th century. I love how this one's like really high. Um, and because they need to look a bit worn for the play because they've been out at sea for eight months, this one's perfect because it's truly a bit wonky. But sometimes that's just what you want, you know? Let that be a lesson for life. If you're feeling a bit wonky, maybe that is just what someone is looking for.